Hello people, it's your girl K-E-R-R-Y Carrie and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I focus on fashion, lifestyle, travel and beauty. So if that is something you are interested in, I would love to have you come and join the crew. So don't hesitate, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you never miss a post. Welcome back to my oldies but goodies. Today's video is another one of my The Style Remix series and in this series I talk about different styles and trends that we have going on. Find them in your closet and restyle them. So I am encouraging you to shop your closet so you don't have to always go out and buy something because that's not always the good thing to do sometimes you have these things tucked away in your closet but because you are not playing around in your closet you do not remember that you have them so today's video is all about the bubble m bubble bubble and it is trending and you can find them everywhere at all different price points I have a few and I'm gonna style them up for you all right welcome back I hope you have your water your coffee your tea your drink of choice have a seat come close and let's get into bubble ends now what are bubble ends now bubble ends are sewn under in a way to create this draping uh, M line it can be in a dress a skirt a top now the bubble M became very popular during the 80s and you know it faded away then it came back in the 2000s so this is a y2k trend that is coming back to us it started like in last year around about the summertime last year but in 2024 bubble m's are all over the place okay they're all over the place and i cannot get enough of them now they're this like playful style it gives you that extra oomph extra detail and as the name suggests bubble poofy effect whether it is on the top and that you should be seeing pictures popping up on the screen to show you examples of those now whether it's at the top whether it is a skirt maxi midi or mini skirt a dress similar maxi midi mini dress but they are all over the place like i said before at different price points so if it is something that you want to try i would suggest not splurging on it if you can get it thrifted or if you can buy it at a more affordable price so if it is not something that you like you're not too mad that you spent a lot of money on this trend and you don't like it for myself I like it it is extra it is my vibe and so I have quite a few pieces in my closet and I'm gonna style them up for you let me know your thoughts in the comments of course let me know is the bubble trend bubble m trend something that you are trying do you have any of these pieces in your closet if you do bring them forward and let's style them for the summer all right the first look that we're gonna go look at is the outfit that i'm wearing now it is on the casual side you guys have seen this before because we know about clothes we wear it one time okay we're gonna style it restyle it wear it multiple ways dress it up dress it down now this is for me a casual look so i'm wearing this oversized uh t-shirt you guys have seen this before <laughs> And here we are again so I'm wearing this oversized t-shirt with Paris written on it I got it from ASOS a while back no longer available but if you want to recreate this look you can definitely do it with any oversized t-shirt that you have on hand and I'm wearing this uh, black bubble skirt it's a mini length like mini somebody other tell me Sam if we go back in go find the rest of the fabric me now have it mom ma'am ma i don't have it me no know wait there i'm gonna buy no more so no tell me that the legs are out it's the summertime okay 
deal with it now so I went for flats so I'm wearing these uh, gold fisherman uh, sandals I got these from Macy's a while back I've been sharing them resharing them here so if you like them I hope that you got your hands on them because I don't think they are available anymore I popped on this uh, necklace uh, it is from uh, Revolve so if it is available still available I'll definitely link it for you and then uh, my uh, silver bag from Jacquemus that bag is sold out and my gold frames from uh, Elisa Johnson and this look eats Abby and I shot this look in Palm Beach and when I tell you we were shooting and I got so many compliments from people just walking by I'll pop up the pictures on the screen to show you from people just walking by like oh my god you look amazing oh my god you look good now if mini is not your vibe you can still recreate this look with a maxi skirt or a midi length skirt but the legs are out baby and I love it keeping this black skirt and I'm gonna style a look for the night time like a party look because again multiple wears how can I style this multiple ways and the name of the series the style remix because we have to be able to wear our clothes multiple times so we can get more bang for our buck okay cause money no grow up on tree that me know so I'm styling the mini uh, bubble M skirt with this corset top I got this corset top from uh, Fashion Nova it's on the cropped ver uh, side it does have boning in there and in this uh, leopard print leopard print is trending right now so when I saw this I was like this is gonna be good with a bubble M skirt and I paired it with this black one that I'm wearing so you should be seeing that on the cutaway I opted to do gold eels and I think I added a red bag for a nice pop of color but if you don't want to add color you can definitely do it with uh, black or gold accessories but either way I love this and I cannot wait to wear this out to a party because it's the summertime and we're outside and we're now come back in okay so let me know which of the looks were your favorite do you prefer the daytime casual look or do you prefer the nighttime uh, dressy look with the corset top let me know in the comments all right since we are on skirts I'm gonna go ahead and continue with the skirt uh, looks so next up I have another bubble M skirt in white I picked this one up from Target and it was only $25 so I didn't or don't I didn't own a white uh, bubble M skirt and I love the trend because like I said it's giving extra and I like it I've already established that I like the trend so of course I am going to stock up not necessarily excessively but if I see something that I really like I am going to get it so I picked this one up from Target it has pockets I love that for me because the black one doesn't have pocket pockets it's from H&M I uh, got this one from Target in a size medium I could have done a small because it does have the elastic in the back so it's easy to pull on and take off um, so this is how it looks it is nice and poofy so I don't mind the medium at all so the first look with this I am going to pop on this uh, vest and this vest is also from Target it's the Janae Naylor future collective collection uh, black vest so I'm going to pop it on with the white uh, bubble M skirt and baby I love I cannot wait to wear this out you're seeing it on the cutaway for accessories I went ahead I grabbed my Jacquemus bag because I'm getting my cost per wear out of that bag okay I slept during the day so I could stay up all night to get it 
And when my sister sent me a text message at 2 in the morning to say it was available, I, I ran. Okay, so we're going to get our cost per wear out of her. Love her. So I paired her with this look. And I just got these ballet flats. They are Alaya um, inspired or dupes. So the Alaya, the Alaya ones are for $1,350. So $1,350. No, ma'am. I just found this one on Amazon for $53. And baby, yeah. She is very comfy, fits true to size. I got her in a size 9. And I am obsessed, okay? I am obsessed with it. I love it. Me already hear my husband ask, so what kind of fishnet business is this? <laughs> but you wouldn't understand. It's fashion, okay? And I did uh, gold accessories to complete the look. And that's the first way we're styling uh, this skirt. I'm going to put the vest away. And I am going to take up this jorts, which is a trending right now as well. So, I am popping on the, I'm turning the skirt into a top. More bang for my buck. So, I just pulled it up, popped on my jorts. But they're basically Bermuda shorts, okay? The new name, jorts. Because I didn't even know that until this year. When they started to call them this. For me, this is a Bermuda shot. Sad that we have to call it. So, popped it on as a top. And I love this so much. I went ahead and popped on my orange uh, Adidas Samba sneakers. And my uh, orange woven bag from Macy's. Uh, for a nice pop of color. And baby, bomb. Oh, scrum delicious yum. Okay, like I'm getting more bang for my buck. Listen, when I pulled this thing up and I looked in the mirror and I saw that it fit, I said, I like this. <clears throat> I love it. So let me know which of the looks were your favorite. Do you prefer it as a skirt? Or do you prefer it as a top? Let me know in the comments. Alright, so I'm going to keep the uh, jorts, Bermuda shorts in my hand. Because I have this uh, Bubble M top that I just picked up from H&M. I saw it online, but I was like real skeptic about buying it. I wanted to try it on first. So I went in stores. I saw it. I was like, I like it. Let me have it, please. And so I picked it up in a size medium. It does have uh, these strings to tie in the back. And you can tie them as tight as possible or loose as possible. It has a cutout V in the back. And the bubble M. Ugh, that poof effect. I love. I also love the crisp white. And so I'm pairing it with the Bermuda shorts. I love. I love. Okay. She's fire. She's fire. So I went ahead and popped on my white wedge from, I got those from Akira. But they are actually, uh, what's the name? It's a, it's a dupe or inspired to a luxury brand i cannot remember the name right now but i got that pair of white shoes for i think like 20 dollars and i love her so i popped her on with this and then for a nice pop of color i added my little orange bag you're seeing that on the cutaway love this is a great look for lunch brunch i'm going to brunch with some of my high school friends and I think I might wear this look. I think I might wear this look. I'm not sure yet, but one of these looks are going to that brunch. One of these looks is going to that brunch, okay? Love this one. So, I'm gonna keep the top in my hand because again, multiple ways. More bang 
for our buck okay good I'm gonna go back in for my white bubble M skirt and I'm gonna create a double bubble right now what I said I'm gonna create a double bubble is it a thing yes even if it wasn't a thing it was gonna be one today because I was gonna do it okay <laughs> so you're seeing that on the cutaway we I love I didn't think it would work my mom came over the other day and she actually thought that this was a set I was like, no they are not together okay but we're going to put them together because she saw my rack and she was like this is a nice outfit I'm like yeah I know <laughs> So we're going ahead and we're styling this with gold. I'm wearing my Barely There uh, gold eels from Steve Madden's. And whenever I'm going like big and extra like this, I try to keep the accessories, especially the shoes, at a minimal. And every day I try to be extra, extra, read all about it, okay? So... And then I popped on my little pink bag. Where is she? Can't hold nothing. Thoughts, feelings, unsolicited opinion. Can't hold nothing. A nice pop of color because it's the summertime. So we need a little color in our life. But if you don't want to do color, you could definitely do gold accessories. So let me know where the top is concerned. Do you prefer it with the uh, jorts or do you prefer it with the skirt? Let me know in the comments. Right, next up, another bubble M skirt. Yes, and another mini. <laughs> this was the first bubble M skirt I got and this was all the way back to last year. And I didn't even know that it was going to be such a big thing. In 2024 but I kept it I was like I love it I wore it once I'll try to find the video and pop it up for you I wore it with a brown sweater and uh, my friend Jeffrey Campbell boots I'll definitely try to find the video and pop it up on the screen so you can see how I wore it and that was during the fall winter rainfall in Jam <laughs> in Florida I call winter and fall rainfall because we don't really experience those seasons but if you know my girl and if, if you know me and if you've been here for a while you know me I dress for the season and I care if it at like 10 fireside when October come the fall outfits are coming out the boots the booties they're coming out okay me not care we are gonna do that the name of fashion so we brought it out for the summertime and the first look is definitely giving fall it's definitely not summer because the way out the door at so i popped it on with this long sleeve denim top this one is from h m but urban revival does have a similar one to this so I'll definitely link it for you the skirt is also from urban revival and I got it in a size uh, US 6 it doesn't have any stretch so I would say size up or stick to your regular size so I popped it on with this and I love I think I did it with red so I think I did red eels I don't quite remember I think I did red eels and red bag just for a nice uh, pop of uh, color oh no I did gold eels so I did my nine West gold eels and my Tory Burch red bag for a pop of color and we love so if I was going to an event that was that would be like on inside I would definitely wear this right now during the fall time pop some boots on and you're good to go I'm keeping the skirt in my hand and I'm going in with another item also from Urban Revival 
and it's this uh, tan or light brown waistcoat and I got it in a US 8 I would say size up one size because the size 6 did not fit I had to return it and it has like a nice gold button right here so I'm popping it on with the skirt and I love the um, the double brown tone for a monochromatic look so I'm gonna keep it monochromatic I kept the gold eels on because it does go with the monochromatic vibes that I'm looking for and then I'm popping on this new in little bag that I uh, just got from the vault label and look at it it is giving luxury <sighs> we're gonna talk about this some more um, in my new in purchases for this month but baby she is a vibe I'm gonna link it so if you're watching this and you like it get it before it is gone it comes also in like a rich burgundy and black I also got the black but I love it with this look she is so chic so classy you're seeing it on the cutaway let me know what you're thinking when it comes to the skirt do you prefer it with the waistcoat or do you prefer it with the long sleeve denim shirt let me know in the comments all right so we're done with the uh the mini skirts and the tops we're going to get into dresses and I have three of them and then we're done with this video so first dress I am wearing it I'm styling it as a skirt why because I also have the same dress in red and I wanted to give a little spin on it so let's go ahead and style this one first and then we're going to talk about the red one which you guys have seen multiple times because again we are going to wear and rewear our outfits okay so it is this pink it has rouging on the side and the bottom of it this pink is uh, metallic so i love that play on it it adds a, an additional oomph to the already bubble m so you can see the skirting is like big and poofy and extra just like how me like it so we're gonna turn this into a skirt so instead of pulling it all the way up here i am stopping it at my waist and i am cinching it and pulling it down so it can give me that uh what would i call it like that ruffle effect around the waistline you are seeing it on the cutaway i went ahead and just paired it with a um a cropped like tank top that's from h&m they always have them i was like at the bottom there's a lot going on so the top need to be as simple as possible if you have like a cropped t-shirt or you can twist it and tuck it under your bra that would work as well and then I just popped on my silver eels to play off of the silver and then if you look at the straps it had, does have the colors in there I love I love and I just popped on my uh, metallic box bag from uh, Brandon Blackwood and you're seeing that on the cutaway again it's giving extra but I like it it is well balanced with minimal going on at the top and then at the bottom extra so again I told you before that they are the same made this one is from Asus this is from a uh, boutique on Instagram uh, Soigne they sent it over to me and I was like but I already have one that looks just the same but so let us do a remix real quick so now the red dress just in case it is your first time on my channel so it's the first time you're seeing this 
I got this picked up this dress from Asus it comes in multiple colors I got it in a size large could have done a medium because the top does stretch um, a bit it has pockets and like I said they are basically the same thing so I'm styling it as it should be a dress I popped on my gold uh, sandals eels from uh, Steve Madden's I love those because this dress a lot is going on so I get to just pop on a simple eels just for height and elegance and I love that and my uh, gold clutch bag from Shein and that's the look so let me know when it comes to these dresses do you prefer it as a dress or do you prefer it as a skirt? Sound off in the comments. And lastly, another dress, and this was the only one that I did not style up multiple ways because I think that this is like a given, it's easy. So it is this uh, mini, like a shot, a shot, a shot bod, but it's bubbling, okay? Like the bubble M is alive and well. You guys would have seen this in a short video. I was going to my friend's bachelor party and I was asking you guys which of the dresses, uh, which of the dress I should wear. And you guys picked the second dress, of course. I got so many comments asking me, where's the rest of the dress? It is too short for your age. Like, fashion has no age. It have no age. So, we're styling it for a party like a nighttime party cue the cutaway we're going to a party so again I popped out the Steve Madden eels and uh, my little gold bag I just got this in from Asus and I love her I'm actually gonna wear this to an all white party for real so <laughs> I'm happy that I have it so I don't have to go and uh, buy something else. So yes, it is short, but I'm going to have some shorts underneath it, of course. Because what if the wind get frisky? So if it is like a day party, I would definitely pop these on. Like these uh, strappy gold uh, sandals would work great for like an all white daytime party that would be perfect or just some regular um slides whether gold silver pop some color on or white if you chose this dress is from akira and i got it in a size medium i'm not sure if it is still available but if it is i'll definitely link it for you and just like that we've come to the end of another video thank you guys so so much for watching and sticking to the end now like I said the bubble and trend is it's going so let me know in the comments if it is something that you are going to try do you already own some bubble M uh, stars and silhouettes in your closet sound off in the comments and let me know which of the looks were your favorite or if you are going to try the bubble M trend this summer even though I think it's gonna go into fall as well because the brands are coming out with the looks okay now if you love my content please make sure that you subscribe hit that notification bell so you never miss a post <laughs> I will catch you in another video but until then be good Mwah.